Hey, brother. Well, as the saying goes, everything's easy when you know how. Um, and I do like the effect. That's pretty cool. If I right-click on that, and you can do the same thing, and choose Save As, you'll see that's just a picture. But more importantly, it is an animated GIF. So what you need to be able to do is create an animated GIF. And there are a lot of programs to do that. Um, Photoshop is one of them, but uh, there are others. And if you wanted to just steal theirs, you could right-click, choose Save Image As, and you'd have it. And that would be the end of that. <laughs> um, and then, uh, but as far as your company name goes, yeah, you'd have to, uh, you have to create an animated GIF. It's not a cakewalk. I think um, Mike could figure it out. Um, if you go online, you'll definitely find, if I go here and just type uh, create animated GIF online, there's probably something out there. So if I type in uh, upload and make a GIF, upload images, animated GIF, and do, 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 do. so it wants you to choose multiple files. So actually what we want to do is from text online. Let's try that out. Uh, create text GIF for free. Here we go. And, uh, and we can... Nice plans. Okay, we'll block that. And we'll font Porky S. I guess you can change your font to, although they may not have. Oh, looks, look at that. It looks like they're going to pick fonts that are on your own computer. So we'll have, uh, oh yeah, what the hell am I talking about? I know what you use. Oh, no, it, it's not picking all fonts on my computer, so it's missing some. So the font is going to be another issue, but I'll just pick a font and create my text GIF. Okay, you've got some text size, different things here. Create it. And uh, there it is. Oh, look, you got sparkles on this one. So you can choose an effect. Uh, interestingly enough, hopefully they have a, a no effect option. No, I do not see a no effect option. But there's going to be a lot of these kind of things online. Uh, so you just need to find the one that fits you, and you'll be able to create something like that online. And that point, I think we can right-click and save the image as <clears throat> a GIF. And that's an, anim that's an animated GIF. And then after you've created a GIF, um, you'll use your email program to create a signature. Now, I'm using uh, Thunderbird, which uh, is far superior to Outlook, I might add. And then I will go in here and... You see right here, attach a signature from a file, and I can choose a signature. And in my case, I have created this file, and it says these things, but I can put a GIF within the contents of that HTML file. It looks like you can also do it right here. Use HTML and paste it right there. I, and, that, and Outlook will have that too. And then you create a little HTML snippet to display what, I, what you have down there, and I can help you with that. So create your GIF and get back to me, and I'll help you with the signature. Talk to you later. Bye.